I know. Grass. Okay, cool. And grass. Yeah. Let's go back and let's choose. There's a video of hagfish. This is a video of a, a mimic fish. A mimic fish? A mimic octopus. Oh, you mean? Fish. Oh, fish mimicking octopus. Very cool. There we go. Video. There we go. So, this is a mimicking octopus. So, when it feels threatened, um, it changes to some like a poisonous snake or anything that will scare the other fish away. See that little hole? That's how it. If it's but if it's something that will eat it, it rushes away with that breathing hole, which it shoots the water out, which makes it a flicking shot. That's really cool. What do you think about this book? Really good. And do you like it? Yes. Yeah. So I think we're probably going to buy a science one. Yeah. We're going a different way. At least you, it's on your wish list, huh? Yeah. <laughs> it is cool. Yeah. Oh, and you can eat octopuses too. Very cool. As born Mysteries and Marvels of Nature. This is the Flexi book. So it's not quite a paperback. It's not quite a hardback. It's nice, thick quality binding cover. The images in this book are beautiful. The pages are all different colors to engage kids. There's interesting little facts. There's a small chunk here with a picture that draws them in. It gives them a little bit of information and gets them excited to want to know more so that they'll read the longer text. Really interesting animals and information about animals in nature. My six-year-old loves this book. He has spent a lot of time looking through this book and asking me to read it to him and asking me, Mom, what does this say? What animal is this? He's really into wild crats. And so some of the animals he recognizes and he'll point to the picture and tell me, tell me about it. And that's really fun for him too, to be able to share information that he's learned. Each of the pages also has an internet link. So you can go to osborne-quicklinks.com and it will, you can look by page number. So you find the title of your book and then say you want to find more about this spider, you put in the page number and it'll give you two to maybe six or eight links with information about the animals or the plants or what have you on those two pages. Um, there's also videos and games and pictures that you can print off. So this would be a great way to write reports about animals for school and it sends them to safe internet websites so that you're not worried about them um, seeing something that they shouldn't see.